Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Gunnar, as well as my assistant Abby and her partner Benny, and we are going to work on some loose leash walking. Now, what we're going to be doing today is walking both dogs in the patio because I really want Gunnar to understand that no matter what dog we're working with, he's still expected to give us a polite walk. Gunnar, let's go. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Now right off the bat, you see Gunner was pulling a little bit ahead, so I just went ahead and gave a correction. Now a correction is a snap or pulse down the leash that's going to communicate to Gunner that what he did wasn't appropriate for the walk. You can see he's really interested in Benny. Come on. But it's really important that we don't encourage any kind of pulling towards Benny as that's going to make our walk a lot tougher. Come on, let's go. Now he's taking these turns like a champ. You see he's doing a great job. Uh -uh. And you can see he's looking at Benny, but I'm just continuing the walk. It's really important that we just keep on walking. Benny's doing a really great job. I love the focus that he's giving Abby. You can see he's definitely distracted by Gunner, but he's not pulling towards Gunner. He's not going to sniff him. None of that. All right, we're going to go ahead and do one more lap. Gunner, come on. Good boy. All right, now when we're ready to stop, we're just going to go ahead, say the dog's name, and then take a couple extra steps. So it's going to be Gunner. Yes, good boy. And that was a really nice job from both dogs. You can see Gunner was definitely interested in Benny. He really wants to play with him. But as you can see, when we're walking, we don't allow any kind of nose-to-nose -nose contact. Overall, really nice job. Come on.